Josh and I have a different line. We have a different threshold. And uh, I think everyone probably has. A di- we all have different thresholds. Mine goes a little further. But um, I think that, you know, for us, it was the, the most important thing was, like, we were not trying to make an exploitation movie, not trying to make a slasher, not trying to have the violence be distracting. And tr- knowing that, we were making a movie with a lot of violence. We had to toe the line so that you don't, the worst thing you could do is make a thoughtful movie and have people walk out of it and be like, oh, that was too bloody. So, you know, it was, it was important for how we shot it, how we handled it, what the tone of the violence was, um, the performances surrounding it. And it was like a delicate balancing act to make sure that we weren't being, yeah, exploited it. Yeah, I mean, you have to, I think the line is the dancing the line of cliche of making it human yeah. in some regard. I mean, you have to, you start with this character who you have to somewhat empathize with, and then by the end, you know, this is a villain in a sense. Not to ruin the movie. I mean, I think it's kind of obvious from the poster, <laughs> but I think that's. I think you don't know. I mean, this is so cliche, but you don't you don't know who you're talking to when you're talking to somebody and what they've been through, you know? And I think that's kind of what you're saying here. And also, like, the idea of just, like, how hard it is to relate to people without having any kind of guidance. And that's what the movie's about, you know? It's like, how do you figure it out on your own? And what if you didn't have, you know what I mean? So, that's why I like you, Nick. (laughs) 